So Elizabeth's little friend Brooklyn is over and she's gonna learn how to walk a horse. Have you ever walked a horse before? Well, this is Warrior and he's really good to start walk, learning to walk with because he's super gentle and he takes some encouragement. So you just gotta start walking and he'll walk with you. Just tug him a little bit. Yep, tug him a little bit. Oh, <laughs> stay on that side. He says, I want to walk that way. Now walk him this way. Good, good job. It's almost like walking a, a dog, huh? I mean, yeah, almost like walking a dog, but... It does not like to be walked. It doesn't want to leave his pipping area. Yeah. But come on, warrior, you gotta walk. You gotta get some exercise. <laughs> you try it, Elizabeth. There we go. Keep going. Good job. <laughs> well, warrior's out for his little walk today. And he's doing so much better, everybody. He's now got a pretty good belly on his... Now we just have to get all that belly going up to his back and his butt area. Yeah. Oh, warrior. But he survived that storm last night. Doing pretty good today. Did you wake up last night from the storm? Yeah, I did. I walked up several times to check on everybody, make sure everybody was okay. You guys are doing I, a good job. I fell asleep instantly and I feel, it felt so nice sleeping in the rain. Go that way. Okay. Good job, everybody. Thanks, everybody, for watching Warrior and keeping up with him and everything. And Every day he gets stronger and stronger. And anybody wants to donate anything for Warrior, we would appreciate it. I think he like, needs a new halter and new lead rope. And I would really like to get him some more supplements. He goes through a lot of um, alfalfa pellets and marinful pellets. So if you guys want to, I go to Tractor Supply in Kingman quite often. Just let me know when you guys want to donate something and make it into the For the Love of the Hoof. And we'll go down and pick it up. Huh, Elizabeth? That's yeah. over by where you live. Yeah. And then that gives me an excuse to well, stop in and see them. <laughs> yeah. I also live in, I don't live in Cayman. I know, but you live close to there. So. I do. <laughs> okay, everybody. Well, thanks for watching. Come on, warrior. Elizabeth, what are you doing? Putting warrior's uh, blanket in the fire. Yeah, what for? So he won't be cold at night? You have to pull real hard. <laughs> there we go. Okay. So we're drying Warrior's blanket so that way he can have something warm this evening when it starts to get cold out. Huh? Yeah. Okay. Okay, so we'll just leave that alone and go back for it. So girls, we're gonna head on downstairs and let you see the newborn baby that was born two weeks ago. Okay. You know what her name is? No. Chrome. Uh-huh. Chrome. Chrome? Yeah, her name's Chrome because she's so fancy. <laughs> so let's go. can ride him so when you guys come by next time if he's still here you guys can ride him okay, okay? so you know how to feed him right Elizabeth hand out peace. Keep, your, keep your thumb it's closed keep your thumb there we go keep it down so he can get it 
Good job. Oh, good job, pirate. You want to try? Go underneath here like that, though, next time. You want to try, Brooklyn? Good job. <laughs> Pirates are really nice guys. So Pirate has partial blindness in one eye, but you would never know it. He, He's super good. Okay, so you want to come and give someone here? This is Luna. Luna was a little kid's horse, and um, she ended up in the auction, which is pretty sad. You want to go ahead and give her some treats? Go under. Go under. There we go. Oh, don't worry. She's not going to bite you. There we go. Just keep your hands like I told you, like this. Cup like that, okay? okay. Cup like that. Okay, put it under. Good job, Brooklyn. Yeah. Okay, and this is Annabelle. Annabelle, probably take a treat. Go under. Good job, Annabelle. Good job, Elizabeth. Want to try Brooklyn? Good job. Yeah. Okay, and this is Buffy. This is Buffy the Vampire Slayer. We named everybody after our October auction. So, go a little. Good job. Good job. Okay, you want to try Brooklyn? Buffy the Vampire Slayer. Buffy needs to get her eye cleaned out today, huh? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I said, I'm going to clean your eye out today, Miss. Oh. Look at that. <laughs> There's head. She, she just did that on her own. Okay, everybody. So we're going to go out and take him out to see the baby. You've had enough, Luna. Hey, girl. So here's baby Crom. Get your baby Crom. Baby Crom and Mama Sabrina. Hi, Sabrina. Yeah. Careful, Sabrina. The, the fence might be on. Oh my God, girl. And here's Sunny. She's about ready to have her baby any day. And thank the Lord she did not have her baby last night in the rainstorm. But you know, if it's a little boy, you know what they're going to call him? What? Moon. Moon? Yeah, because she's sun and it will be moon, right? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> here's Crow. Maybe be Crow. She's Hi, looking she's good, huh? Yeah. Isn't she pretty? Yeah. yeah, she's really pretty. Look at baby. Do this. <coughs> Sometimes she answers back. Be good. Oh, <laughs> she's stomping her butt. <laughs> Sometimes she does. But there's our little baby. Yeah. And Sunny, I am home now. And the weather's starting to be nice. So you can have that baby any day. I am right here for you, girl. <laughs> We're Are gonna... you here when she had a baby? Yeah. I wasn't here. I was actually, since I broke my wrist, remember? Um, you broke your wrist? Yeah, I had to go get that cast on it. And so then... Um, Wait, nobody told me you Nobody told me you broke your wrist. Oh, yeah, I broke my wrist. So I, uh, well, I fractured it. Same thing, though. And so I had to go get a cast on it. And so Pa was here, and Pa actually saw the baby being born, and he helped her be born. And so when I asked him what so she wait, looked like, like he said that she had lots of chrome on her. And that's a term that people in the ho horse world say when the baby is born real fancy. And my friend Renee, who was here, you know Renee, right? Yeah. She says, yeah, she's got a lot of chrome on her, Wendy. And I said, well, guess what her name is? Chrome. <laughs> so that's how chrome became, got her name. And chrome was uh, Sabrina and Sunny were two of the horses of the uh, 18 horses and a donkey that we rescued back in May from a backyard breeder in New Mexico and it was a pretty intensive <laughs> rescue so you can watch that on our Facebook page and our YouTube page and how they became rescued and now they're here and going to have their babies the yeah <laughs> Why eat the poop? oh well that's because she's just smelling it she's not eating it she's just smelling it she says is that mom's poop yep that's mom's poop so babies smell and taste everything when they're babies just like Regular babies, right? Yeah. Oh, cool. All right, so let's turn this off for a minute. Go look at that thing crawling on the ground right there. What? So that is a giant grasshopper. Hi, Ellie. <laughs> giant grasshopper, huh, Ellie? <laughs> I want to oh, no, you can't there. because the fence is on, remember? So she knows not to get there. there. Hi, Ellie. Hi, Ellie. That was a giant grasshopper, wasn't it? And here's our sheep after they've eaten. They're just hanging, laying them down here. And that's mama sheep. She's going to have another baby, Elizabeth. Yeah. Baby until she 
She had to, remember? That's one of her babies next to her, but she's gonna have oh, another baby. Her. Yeah, she's she gonna have another baby. Yeah, she's gonna have another baby. And that's our majestic boy over there. Remember him? And here we all are. Okay, well, it's gonna start to dry up a little bit, we hope, and we're gonna start to be able to grade the pastures. Boop, 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 boop. So thanks for joining us all, everybody, and um, stay boop. tuned for more episodes. Say bye, girls. Bye. bye. So everybody, we're kind of out here at my on my son's piece of property right now, and uh, they're making a weekend shower. <laughs> So when he comes and stays out in his uh, little camper thing here, you know, there's uh, five of them. So he's like, that shower's too small for me, so I'm going to make an outdoor shower. So we're going to uh, watch them uh, put this roof on. Hey, he, he, that, he got that uh, thing for free, uh, the shed for free, and he took it apart, and he brought it all the way out here, and now he's going to put it up. There you go. And that, my friends, is going to be a hillbilly weekend shower. So I'm out here grading the pasture, and look what I find underneath the tree. Hey, Mama! Are you sitting on some eggs? Are you sitting on some eggs, Mama? Boy, I would really love to have some baby ducks, because I love my ducks. They're so cute. They're quack, 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 quack. Yeah, so just out grading the pastures, guys, and uh, just had to stop to show you real quick. My mama duck sitting on her eggs. So I'm out here grading the muddy pastures, and this is a perfect time to get your babies used to a quad. Yeah, a quad and a drag. And hi, Chrome! Hi! Because they're going to encounter a lot of ATVs and four-wheelers and stuff when you're on trail and you just don't want your horses to be scared of them. So our horses get desensitized to a lot of things here. Um, that's one of the reasons why we keep... Let me turn this off here. That's one of the reasons why we keep our cows and sheep around is because... Um, and our dogs is because all our horses here... They get desensitized to cows, sheep, goats, uh, chickens, ducks, other horses, mules, ATVs, four-wheel drives. My husband and my son restores um, horse trailers. And so if anybody needs a horse trailer restored, get a hold of us because that's what they do for a living. And um, so they're getting desensitized to all kinds of things like the welder noise, loud banging and clanging, and all kinds of construction tools. And of course, the chainsaw is always going to cut down wood so that we can um, get ready for winter time. Here comes the baby. Here comes the baby. They're looking at the kids over there driving the workmen. Hi, girls! <laughs> they're over there. Um, driving the workmen and they think it's food time here they go they think oh it's food time <laughs> but yeah so I'm just out here grading the pastures today well trying to anyways it's so muddy but any little bit helps and uh, I just wanted to show you how good the horses do around the quad so I'm kind of hiding right now in the house from everybody because I need to get dinner started for, I think there's 15 of us today. And so I just wanted to tell everybody thanks for watching. And um, I hope that you turn in for our episodes more often. Have a great Sunday, everyone. God bless you.